Oh, hey, how's it going? Pete Makwa, defensive tackle, St. Joseph's by the Sea, Staten Island, New York. I chose Notre Dame well because I'm Catholic, I love football, and this is the best decision for me and my family. I just have one last thing to say. I am Irish. An interesting story was uh, Coach Kelly and I were in the school and um, we were meeting Peter for the first time. Coach Kelly and I, Coach Van Gorder had already been through there. And at, this was at 2.15, 2.30, and at 3 o'clock, Peter was being picked up by Rutgers to go on his official visit. And um, we get a knock at the door about 2.45. They call one of the coaches out, and the coach comes back in, and, and he's a little distraught and a little panicked and said, you know, i got to stop this right here. We need to, we need to get – I feel a little uncomfortable right now with, with Rutgers right next door and Notre Dame here and, and them here to pick him up to go on his visit. Well, long story short, he cancels the Rutgers visit, visit and he commits to Brian Kelly. So um, it, in a matter of 30 minutes, he, we, we went from trying to get him on campus to come on a visit to he's coming to Notre Dame. So it turned very really quick. And, um, you know, Pete's a very passionate young man. He knows exactly what he wants. He went to a school very similar to Notre Dame. Uh, he's a Catholic fan, comes from a Catholic family. Mother's Nigerian and um, just a well-rounded young man that knew exactly what he wanted. And when he, when he heard Coach Kelly talk, that's what he was looking for, and he committed right there. Well, if you're going to have a guy in the interior that you need to occupy blockers and be what we call a two-gapper, uh, then that's the type of body that you want because uh, Pete is a physical bowling ball type of a player that not only is above 300 pounds now but will probably escalate there and be a, f a force and a presence in the middle of that defense that keeps offensive linemen off the linebackers behind him. Notre Dame's had tremendous success with that with the likes of Lewis Nix. And now to be able to get another player like that that can hold the point, I think is critical to the overall interior success of any run defense. Pete's a big man, as if you, if you haven't seen him. He's a, a big guy, 6'3", about 315 pounds right now. Uh, he's carrying a little bit of cargo. He'll transfer that into – Coach Longo will get him to transfer that into some horsepower. But he's just got great initial quickness. He's a big space eater, very aggressive player, uh, very athletic for his size, and gives us much added depth at a defensive tackle position that we need right now. He said something in the, in the interview that we had with him that was pretty interesting. He said, I know that they're trying to run the football to my side. I don't understand how I can allow this guy to block me and not make the play every time. So he's got an understanding that of this dominating spirit, which we like. You know, expectation of dominance at the defensive line is what we're looking for. We want to be the best, and he's shooting to be the best.